Hello everybody, my name is Quad MFT, the man, the myth, the legend here, bringing you a PP90 MOAB on the map Foundation, which is actually a downloadable content or a DLC map. And you don't see many gameplays on the YouTube community like this, so I thought I would bring you something different because nowadays most commentators like to focus on the gameplay a little bit more, so they like to disable DLC and get with the more newbie players who don't actually give a lot of money into this game. But I personally paid my cold, hard cash for this map. I'm going to play it, I'm going to enjoy it, and you're going to enjoy watching the MOA be on it. But... I actually have a topic for today, and it's kind of a sad topic. I know a lot of my commentaries are like this, but I guess it's what you guys are enjoying because I've been getting a lot of good feedback for this. And I'm talking about the whole YouTube smaller community thinking that gameplay matters more than commentary. Now, some of you may be saying, I don't think it. I know that gameplay matters more than commentary, but I have something different to say. I have to say commentary matters the most. The effort that you put into the video is what's going to come out. The the time and effort in the commentary and whatever you do the better quality of mic you have the better video recording software you have whatever you have the more effort you put in your video it should be getting more views it should be getting all the publicity it deserves and it will but what I've been seeing nowadays has been a little bit unfair now whether it be unfair it is not just either this is something that what I'm gonna be talking about gameplay people going in and going 62 and 1 like me but having support runners, having eight people behind them running constantly UAV ballistic vests. Now, nor am I complaining about this at, in the slightest. It is completely fine with me. We have been through this before. But when people abuse this, when people abuse their subscribers, I mean, I, I'm fine with that. I know Jay Nasty abuses his subs, but at least he's cool about it. At least he's kind of a cool guy. But when people do that and they just say, yep, I'm bringing you a 70 and one commentary and they don't even talk well the whole video. They just completely blank out, have no topic. And people are like, what, what, what do you mean? Why would I have a topic for this video? My videos are completely and no matter what, always going to be at the co about the commentary and hearing my voice and talking. Or if even if it's not, it's going to be some pretty freaking entertaining gameplay if I'm able to post it without any commentary or any music over it. It's kind of sad to see where the smaller YouTube community has gone nowadays. That's why I'm trying to get out of it. That's why I've been posting a little bit more every week, trying to get out of it, trying to get a partnership, doing whatever I can to get myself out of this gameplay ways. People automatically assume that Modern Warfare 3 commentators are gameplay boosters. Now, now that gameplay boosting has kind of gone over a little bit, I still reminisce it a little bit, and I'm sad that the YouTube community, at least the smaller community, even went there in the beginning. It still goes on nowadays, but at least those people who do that don't get as many views as they did in the past. Bigger commentators obviously don't gameplay boost. They People like Woody's Gamertag will post a 30 and 13 or something like that and be able to carry the whole video by his commentary. You're just how actual entertaining and how much product value that video has. It's just truthfully amazing, and that's what I'm trying to do and strive to do with my Quad MFT YouTube channel. So I hope you guys have been actually enjoying my channel because I'm trying to be a little bit different. I know my gameplays are still Moabs, but they're still solo. And it's not my fault that I go on 25 gun streaks while using specialists. It's not like I'm going for Moabs. I just click specialist to level up and get more perks and stuff like that because I love being that super soldier. It is such a great feeling. I really can't get over it, and that's why I continually use specialist over and over. And I bet some of you guys do too, but I like to switch it up with assault to keep stuff fresh. You guys have seen my assault gameplays before. You know I can still hold it up and I don't have to have all these perks to do well. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You can definitely leave a comment down in the comment section below if you think gameplay matters more than commentary. And I cannot stress that. I'm going to say it again. Do you think gameplay matters more than commentary? I won't be biased at all. I won't delete the comments if you say gameplay matters more. But just really, tell me your actual opinion in the comment section below. Like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more. It's been Quadum FT, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching this video, and on the left you'll be able to click on my most recent Weird Weapon Wednesday, a series I have going on every single Wednesday, and on the right it will take you to a mystery slash surprise video. It's been Quad MFT, I'll see you guys next time.